What is good, everybody? It is your boy, Pat, the designer, back at it again. How are y'all feeling today, Chicago? So a lot of questions have been raised about whether Zach Levine should or shouldn't be an all-star in this 2020 season. Let's talk about it right after this. Can, uh, can somebody cue the intro real quick? Appreciate you. All one. All two. All three. Stop it! Don't do it like that! Mercy! Did you not get the memo? Before we get into the video, if you are a Chicago sports fan, please like the video. Please subscribe to the page because we do talk Chicago sports weekly, and we don't want you to miss a thing, so make sure that you hit that bell. Thank you very much. Now, a lot of people have been asking me, should Zach Levine be an all-star? Do you think Zach Levine should be an all-star? Why should Zach Levine be an all-star? And I'm split on it. I'm split on it. Um, do I think that Zach Levine should be an all-star? No. But do I think that Zach Levine will be an all-star? Yes. And here's kind of the reasoning that I'm working with on that. Uh, Zach Levine's having a great season. Nothing to take away from anything that Zach has done this season. Um, his scoring, he's having one of his best scoring seasons ever. Um, he's honestly the main reason that the Chicago Bulls even are in games a lot of times. Uh, he is an offensive juggernaut when he wants to be, which by the way is every night. But at the end of the day, it's not translating to wins. It's not translating to the Bulls being a successful team. It's not translating to the Bulls being a team that people fear, that people are worried about because they're just not a good basketball team at the end of the day. Now, is that Zach's fault? Should Zach be penalized for that? No, but usually when you're on an all-star team, you usually have players from better teams. And so I think that Zach shouldn't be in there because I do think the guys are on better teams that are ahead of him, that are putting up better numbers than him, um, or at least they're doing more to help their team get wins. Now, do I think that Zach Levine will be an all-star? Absolutely. Before I continue, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Do you think that Zach Levine will be an all-star in 2020? The fact that the game's in Chicago, I think that that's enough alone. I think that Zach is going to be an all-star uh, this season. I believe that it wouldn't be so much of a like, oh my God, you just did it because it was Chicago thing, because it's not like he's having a bad season, or it's not like you put somebody like Cristiano Felicio or Otto Porter, or those were two names that didn't need to go in the same context. My apologies to Otto Porter. You are a real NBA player. Cristiano Felicio, you're not. But I think the fact that it's in Chicago gives Zach a little bit of that extra boost, a little bit of that extra oomph, because I believe that the NBA is going to want a representative from Chicago. Now, might they still think, well, that representative is Derrick Rose, who will be coming back home. Uh, I wouldn't be upset if Derrick got the nod over Zach, personally. Again, let me know in the comments below, would you rather see Derrick Rose or Zach Levine in the All-Star game? But I just think that um, they're going to want a Chicago Bull to represent Chicago while it's in our city while it's in our home. Uh, I think that Jerry Reinsdorf is going to push for it. I think that uh, Bulls upper management is gonna push for it. And I think that the NBA is gonna kind of acquiesce to that because uh, it's a bad look. If you're in your city and no one from your city is an all-star that season, no one from your city uh, gets that bid. So I do think that Zach Levine will be in the all-star game personally, but I just think that there's players who probably deserve it more who aren't gonna get that nod because it's not in their city. As I said before, let me know in the comments below what you think. Should Zach Levine be an all-star in 2020? I am going to get up out of here. It is your boy, Pat the Designer, back at it again. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the page. Y'all stay safe out there, man. Peace.